All right, boys and girls, before we get into this video, you may or may not know by now, after overwhelming support on the video that I asked your opinion about, you know, maybe starting a Patreon page, I've decided to go ahead and make one because the support that I got in the comments section on that video was, was ridiculous. Uh, I'm really taken back by it and I, I appreciate everybody's support. So I've started a Patreon page for those that, that want to help out. I actually just up, got that done today and I've already got three patrons on there which is fantastic. So I really, really appreciate the support um, from everybody. So you can go to patreon.com forward slash Ludix Aviation. You'll find it there, go and have a look. Thank you, uh, I'll let you get on with the video now. And uh, yeah, enjoy it, support the channel. And uh, yeah, let's keep going. All right, enjoy the video. Orlando Executive Tower 32042, holding short of runway 25, ready for the power shirt. Number 32042, Orlando Executive Tower, proceed northwest bound, runway 25 at Alpha 2, clear for takeoff. Cleared for takeoff, 042. Beautiful. Let's do it! She flies. She flies. Welcome to the sky. Welcome to the sky. There you go. Good stuff. Just make sure that we stay on the center line of the runway, right? We got, right. we got. I'm seeing the runway over this side, so just back us over this way. Beautiful takeoff, though. Man. Awesome. Very, very nice. Not gonna lie, though, I felt a little bit late. A little bit late. Yeah. yeah you kind of let the airspeed come up higher than than we normally would, but that's not a problem. Cherokee three two zero four two, maintain VFR outside of the class Bravo airspace. Frequency change is approved. Frequency change approved. Zero four two. Go for it. Frequency approved, 042. Nice, cool. All right, over to the lake, please, sir. I'm liking how you're keeping altitude today, man, already. I'm Doing well. Prepared, Finally, we get to fly again. Right? We've had, oh we've... my gosh, it's been, I, I was getting anxious. Yeah. Like, my, my hands were twitching, like, okay, you're starting <laughs> yeah, to forget. Yeah, you're getting withdrawals. Yeah, we've been trying to fly for the past, I don't know, a week. Oh, yeah. And the weather's just not been good, so. No. Okay. Let's do one more. Let's do it's it. It's been a while. My <laughs> controls. Your controls. My controls. All right. So we've done all the pre-maneuver checklists. Do you see anybody in the area? I'm not seeing anybody. Nope. That's a good thing. Nope. Right. Okay. My heading that I'm going to use is 330. I want to maintain that heading, right? Yes. So, power's coming back. All right. The power's back. I'm maintaining altitude. We're within the white arc. First notch of flaps. we still got 2500. Still got 330. About 75 knots. Second notch flaps. 2500. Uh, 330. Uh, airspeed's going down. Third notch of flaps. What's my airspeed currently? Right now it's going to go down to 60. 60. Right about there, I'm going to pull the power. I'll push the power back up to about 1800, 1900 RPM. That should, in theory, keep me where I want it to be. And uh, yeah, just like that. Look at that. About 60 cool. knots, 2500. Now the nose wants to drop away from me. So I'm going okay. to trim back a little bit to help me out. Yeah, trim it up. Sorry. Exactly. Get that nose trimmed up. And then there we go. We're in slow flight. Yeah, show the people. We got all <laughs> full air on control. So, there we go. Cool. Makes sense. How do we do turns in slow flight? Uh, we use the rudder. Yes, we do. Maybe a little bit of air on, but yeah, yeah. mainly mainly rudder. How do we recover from slow flight? Uh, we pick up speed a little bit. Pick up speed. So full power. Nose over to the horizon. One notch flaps. Notch. Let it accelerate. That's that's the key. If we drop yeah. out the flaps too too quickly, I'm going to show you what that that feels like actually. We drop the flaps out too quickly. I'm gonna keep power off, right? Right. But I'm gonna drop out the flaps. You feel that air airplane drop? Yeah. Because uh, there's no, you're getting rid of the flaps, so the lift it decreases exactly. immediately. So that's why he wants to go down. Exactly. On a situation where we go around, let's say we don't like the landing, that the the way that the landing is looking, and if we put full power in and just drop all the flaps straight away on a go around, we're gonna sink towards the ground. We don't right. want that, so we remove them in stages. Okay. Your controls. My controls. Your controls. Give me some slow flight, man. So we're going to lower it down to around 1600. Keep Good. the heading. There you go. Perfect. All right. Everything's good. Then we'll do the first notch. First notch. Just make sure it's not climbing. Right. We don't need too much pitch up. There you go. And it's going to lower it down to there. Beautiful. Then we do another notch. Yes, sir. Just make sure we're not turning to that right side. There you go. Right. Stabilize that. Put on the, the heading at 33. All right. Now that we're here, we do one final notch. Final notch. 
Ready? To go down to... Yep, kind of get that pitch up so you can get it back, so you can get it down to like 60 knots or so. There you go. And then what do you put in the power to? This is just about a little bit. 1800 or so. Should keep you where you want to be. Look at this. Slow flight. Welcome to slow flight, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Beautiful. Slow flight. Very nice. You can feel how much hotter it just got in the cockpit because of yeah. the, like, the reduced airflow. My yeah. controls. Your controls. All right, so that entry, the way that you entered into that slow flight with the flaps is, yeah. is the entry into a power off stall. So what a power off stall is, is you were, were basically in flight, we're simulating that we're coming into land, right? right? And maybe we flare too much, okay? We, we pull back too much on the on the yoke and we stall the aeroplane, right? right? Close to the ground. We don't want to do that. No. I, I don't want to die. I don't know about them. We've got to learn how to stall the plane safely and how to recover it in that situation. All right, so I'm pulling the power back. This is all the same entry to that, that slow flight, right? right? We're within the white arc, there's one notch of flaps, maintaining altitude, maintaining heading, 75 knots, second notch flaps, maintaining everything again, letting it slow down. Third notch of flaps, right? I'm letting it slow down to 65. At 65, I'm simulating a descent to go into landing, right? right? Now on landing, we want power idle. Right. All right, and we just start pulling back very slowly. We're not jolting the plane back, just slowly bringing it back, slowly bringing it back, and we should feel the stall. There's the stall warning. The nose goes away. Full power. Look how easy that stall was. Oh, man. One notch of flaps. We've got positive rate of climb, so I took the second notch of flaps out. Above 80 knots, I'm going to take the third notch of flaps out, just like we do for recovery on slow flight, and it's as simple as that. It it's go back to cruise. a really easy stall. You should never be afraid of stalling a plane. Nope. You're always in control. Right. Your controls. My controls. Your controls. I'm going to walk you through it. So, All right. power back to 1700. Alright, power back to 1700. Yes, sir. Power back. There you go. Lift the nose just a little bit so we don't descend. Right. Alright, just just a touch. Not too much. Not too much. Alright, get that uh, first notch flaps in. First notch of flaps. First notch. There it is. We're stabilized, right? Stabilized. 75. Second notch flaps. Get it notch. in. Alright. We're stabilized. We're still at 2500. Still on like 200. Yeah. Third notch flaps. Third notch. Beautiful. There's 65. Push the nose down very, very gently. Pretend we're going into land. We're descending towards the runway. Okay. Yeah. Power all the way idle. Bring right, the power all the way, way back. Battle. And then slowly bring the nose back. Keep keep one hand on the throttle though. Right. And slowly bring the nose up. Keep it coming up. Keep it coming back. Keep it coming back. Keep it coming back. Keep it coming. Yep. Pull it. Pull it. Pull it back. Keep it coming. And there's the stall. Full power. Power all the way full. There you go, man. You just did your first stall. Brilliant. Beautiful. One notch of flaps out immediately. There you go. And then we climb away. Maintain your heading. Man, that, that's your first stall, man. And you only lost 100 feet on it. That's within that's the, within the standards for, for a check ride. Really? <laughs> that's pretty sick. A good landing starts with a, a good pan. So you can see we're coming a, a beam out of touchdown point, right? Yes. So power back. One notch of flaps, right? One notch. There first notch. Looking good. Keep, keep that nose down. We want to yeah. get that descent rate going. If you need to back off the power to get the descent rate, we'll look. We're, then you, you can do that. Don't turn just yet. You want to like turn? Because uh, we got the other traffic. That's right. the issue. All right. Get your second notch of flaps in on base. Second Again. notch. And then keep us at 75 right. knots on base. Right. See how the, the nose wants to rise up when you put the flaps in? Right. Yeah, push over. Push Give yourself a, a, roll of, a roll or two of trim forward. There you go. This is a beautiful angle. All right. Nice and symmetrical. Level off. Level off, right Level off the wings, keep the right. nose coming down, but just use power as required. See, this is a sloppy turn on the final, Yeah. but it's it's fine, we're learning. So keep one hand on the throttle, one hand on the... there you go. Third notch of flaps. Maintain VFR outside the class there you go. Space All right. So we're looking for 65, but keep that nose keep that nose down. And just bring that power back a little bit, because we're too high, right? Yeah. Remember in slow flight, if we want to descend, we reduce power. If we want to ascend, if, if we want to climb, we uh, add power. It's the same kind of thing. Beautiful. Roger, you felt how we kind of dropped altitude right. then because the power came back beautiful. If you feel yourself dropping too much or getting too low, add a little, a little bit of power. Exactly. Pull us onto the center line a little bit. Keeping that nose into into the wind. This is going to be kind of a crosswind landing, which is a little bit ahead of our stage. But look at that airspeed. You're looking beautiful. That's looking good. That's the last time we're going to check in. Looking good. We're coming in. All right. Start pushing the uh, the left rudder a little bit and dipping into the wind with the aileron. There right. you go, looking good. All right, now eyes to the end of the runway. Slowly kind of hold it back with power idle. Power idle, slowly hold the nose back, slowly hold it back. <laughs> Beautiful, man. Beautiful. My controls? Your controls. Good job, my friend. You saw I was hands off then. I was hands off for the touchdown. Beautiful. Good job, man.